Greetings to you all, everyone. How's it going? I hope everyone is doing amazing. It's your girl Claudia from CookieWithClaudia.com. Today, I'll be showing you how to make super delicious coconut fried rice with shrimp and beef. So to start off, you want to start by blending some coconut. Do not throw the water away, okay? Go ahead, add in some water, and you want to blend that until it is smooth. Now drain or strain it. You can use a sieve like me, or if you have like a squeeze or a strain bag, you can as well use that. Now when you have the coconut water, go ahead and add in your washed rice. Make sure your rice is perfectly washed, okay? Now add in salt, curry powder, and I will also be using some coconut flavor. If you do not have the coconut flavor, you can skip that part, okay? Now cook the rice until it is tender. For our beef, go ahead and season that with some black pepper, garlic powder, salt, and paprika. Mix that until everything is well coated. For the shrimps, we'll be using some paprika, salt, black pepper, and garlic powder. It's going to be the same ingredients you used in marinating the beef, okay? So after you marinate that, let us check on our rice. See, that has been cooking for some time. It is looking so good and fluffy. In the pan, go ahead and add in some oil. Now cook your beef until it is well brown on both sides. At this point, your beef is supposed to be fully cooked. So guys, our beef here is really soft. If you're in Cameroon or maybe anywhere back home, you can boil it first, okay? You don't want to end up with really, really hard beef. I will also cook the shrimp for about two minutes each side until it is fully cooked. Now let's make our fried rice. Add in some oil in your pot or pan. Saute some onion and garlic until the onion becomes soft and fragrant. This is going to take roughly about 2 to 3 minutes. Now when it is soft, bring in your carrots. Your carrots are supposed to be diced, okay? Next, I'll be using some bell peppers. I have a mixture of yellow and red bell peppers there and some green beans. Give that a good stir and some of the ingredients are going to follow. Also, in this recipe for my um, fresh herbs, I will be using some leeks. You can, if you do not have the leeks, you can also use green onion, okay? Make sure you save some of the green onion or leeks for later to garnish. To taste, add seasoning powder black pepper salt paprika you want to give that another good stir then we'll bring in our rice and you have to mix again well until your rice is perfectly coated with that beautiful sauce in there so when you mix your rice you're gonna bring in your beef and the shrimp okay so in this recipe you can choose either you use beef only you use shrimp only chicken only whatsoever protein you choose to use is gonna work well right now you want to give that a final stir And finally, the last but not the least ingredients, I have my fresh leeks that is just to garnish. At this point, my heat is turned off, okay? Let the residual heat do its magic with the leeks. And everything is looking so delicious. If you get to try this recipe, please let me know how it turns out. If you have any questions whatsoever, do not hesitate to drop it and I'm going to reply ASAP. And thank you so much for all the love, the comments, and the likes. And don't forget to grab the recipe below, okay? Until we meet again in my next video. Bye for now, and I love you all.